Easy peasy. Let's start with a squat. Right and left. Go. Right, left. I start by saying good morning. Welcome to Mini Bed Madness. Let's get this party started. Press into your heels. Just start moving. 15 seconds. All you need is a mini band. It's the last time I'm going to say it. 10 to go. On deck. Reverse lunge. In five. Four, you stay here. Four, three, two. Left leg forward, right leg back. So left leg forward, right leg back. Stay on your left leg. Drop your right knee down. We're here for eight more seconds, and then we hold it. We're starting to heat up the glutes. Two more. Last one. Now hinge into your left leg. Knee over ankle, arms up. Knee to elbow, go. Knee to elbow, knee to elbow. Start to warm it up. You've got eight, six, four, three, two. Switch legs, right leg forward, left leg back. Right leg forward, left leg back. So this should feel kind of awesome in your left quad. Keep moving. 10 seconds. Same thing. We hold it down in four. In three. Last two. Hold it low. Hinge forward, arms are up. Knee to elbow, go. Knee to elbow, knee to elbow. 10, nine. Eight, seven, six, and five. We jog in place in four, three, two. Stand up, just jog in place. Roll your shoulders back. You can stay here or start to bring your knees up. Knees up, knees up. I'm giving you 15 seconds right out of the gate. Let that heart rate rise. You got it. In 10 seconds, you come into your high plank. So you can you get just a little breathless here? Three, two, hit the deck, high plank. Now if you're on your knees, it's all good. World's greatest stretch. Right foot, right hand. Hand comes down, foot comes back. So if you're on your knees, you can still execute the exact same thing. But keep flowing through that world's greatest stretch. You have 15 seconds. Once we get into our workout today, we will execute everything between 30 and 45 seconds. Blocks of exercises. In 10 seconds, you come back to your plank. Good morning. Five seconds, we meet back in the plank. Four, three, two, so meet back in your plank. Walk your hands into your feet, arms out, legs out, seal jacks, go. Seal jacks. So keep moving, low impact, tap and tap. Now, I chose this in your warm up to open up your chest, your shoulders, your back. You have 15 seconds. Keep going. In 10, we lateral lunge right. I hope when I say right, it shows you right. Four, three, two, let's go right, reach. Stay on the right side. You got it. Step out with the right foot, send your right glute back. One more, switch sides, same thing. Left, reach, left, reach, you got it. Team, you got five seconds. Now we're gonna jack it out. Last one. Regular classic jumping jacks. 30 seconds. So everything today, 30 to 45 seconds, you are jacking. The only piece of equipment last time I said, I promise, is the mini band. And on deck in 15 seconds, we go back to the top. So what does that mean in 10 seconds? That means you will squat right and left. Keep moving. You have five, four, three, two, let's go. So it's right, center, left. The second set, you should feel more prepared for what's coming. Keep moving. 
Press into your heels, squeeze your glutes as you stand up. 15 seconds. Oh. Reverse lunges next in 10. It's about to say alternating, but that's not where we go. In five, four, three, two, left leg forward, lunge it. Right leg back, stay there. Left leg forward, right leg lunge. We add on here. Left leg forward, right leg back, press into your heel. In three, hold it low. Two, hold it. Now stay here, go down an inch, up an inch. Down an inch, up an inch. Eight seconds. On deck, power knees, four, three, two, hinge forward, ready, go. Knee to elbow, knee to elbow. Come on, so you came up a little bit, but your hamstring is on fire. You have seven seconds here, and then you jump rope. Yes, yes, great, jump rope. So you're shaking it out, setting yourself up, just 10 seconds, keep moving. On deck, right leg forward, left leg back. Three, two, right leg forward, left leg back. First 15 seconds is active. Second 15 seconds, we hold and pulse. Then we add that power knee. So two more. Hold this one. Down an inch, up an inch. Down an inch, up an inch. It's micro, but it's powerful. You have eight seconds. So you get to come up ever so slightly and hinge forward in three, in two, hinge, arms up, go. 15 seconds. There you go, 10 to go. Looks good, looks good. You got it, Paula. Five seconds. High plank. Three, two, high plank. Press your hands into your ground. Pull your belly in. Lift your hips up, down dog. Now come forward. Rotate your right knee to your left elbow. Send your right toe back. Come up, hinge forward left to right. Now, if you are on, off of your toes, you can create a bird dog, right arm, left leg, left arm, right leg. So everybody has options for these next eight seconds. <sighs> Lift your hips, knee to elbow, last one, high plank, hands into feet, stand up, seal jacks, 30 seconds. There we go. Love it. 20 seconds. So on deck, we're going to grab our mini bands. You are just opening up the chest, opening up the shoulders, going crazy here. You've got 10. Love it. You look good. You got it. In five, in four, we grab our mini bands. Three, two, break. So grab your mini band. Put it just above your knees. Just above your knees. I'll give you about 10 seconds to meet me here. Just like our warm up started, we squat right and left. In four, in three, two, go. So it's right, center, left. So the mini band is there to create that little extra bit of tension. Make sure you drive your knees out. 15 seconds, keep squatting. We will come to center in eight. Left leg first in four, in three, two. So come to center. I want you to squat, stand up, press into your left heel, lift your right leg up. Join me, squat, left, lift right. We've got 30 seconds, this side. So press into your left, lift and squeeze right. You have 10 seconds. Zip your belly in. Two more. Last one, switch sides. So same squat, shift right, lift left. Same squat, lift. Flex your left foot. Send your left toes forward. We have 15 seconds. 
We go back to the top in 10. What does that mean? That means we go back to the side to side. Last one. And go. Squat, center. Squat, center. Alternating sides. You got it. One more set, both things. So outer glutes, outer thighs. No holds, no pulses yet. Yet. 10 seconds. When we come back into our stationary move, in five, we'll start on the right. Three, two, squat, stand, shift right, lift left, go. Squat, stand, you got it. Now, keep moving. If you're leaning over, lift your spine tall, squeeze that left glute. Fight the urge to fall to the right. There you go. Yes, much better. Two more on this side. Last one. Switch sides. So same squat, shift left, lift right. So it's not this. It's lift and squeeze. 15 seconds. You got it. We're not in a hurry. 10 seconds. On deck, last squat, in five, you hold it, in four, three, two, so meet me here. So meet me here, in this squat, knees up, check, chest tall, check. Up for two, down for two. Up for two, down for two. Stay there. I know, it feels so good. Last one. Now hold it down and pulse it for 10, for 9, for 8, for 7. You've got 6 and 5. Come on, 4, 3, 2, stand up. Mini band to your ankles. So if you do not execute push-ups, you're going to come down to your back for chest press. Everybody else, mini band is at your ankles. First exercise, reach, hinge, walk it out. Two push-ups, two plank jacks, walk it in, stand up. Ready, go. Reach, hinge, walk it out. Two push-ups, one, two, two plank jacks. Now there are about 18 different ways you can modify this. You can come down to your knees. You can turn the plank jack into a toe tap. You can be on your back for a chest press. You need to pick the option that works for you. You still have 10 seconds left, and then we're going to stand up for our first cardio push. It's a tap jack in five. In four, you got it, Julie. Three, two, so I'm watching you stand up. You're here, down and up, down and up. 30 seconds, let's go. Let's go, let's go. If you're not a jumper, you're back to that side-to-side -side squat. But it should feel very different with that mini band around your ankles. Love it, Lauren. I know this is what you came for. Come on, you have 15 seconds. So I said, blocks of exercises, washing, rinsing, repeating. You have five seconds. Give yourself three more. Two more. You got at least the last one. Reach up. Back to the top, go. Walk it out. One, two, one, two. Oh, I gotta walk it in. Stand up, do it again. There we go, perfect. And take that break at the top. Own that big stretch. Remember at the top, when we first started in our warm up, I did that seal jacks? It was to prepare you for exercises like this. You have 10 seconds left. There you go. So finish up your last one. We stand up for those tap jacks in three, two, everybody up. Meet me here, 30 seconds. Down and up, down and up. Alternate which hand touches the ground. Keep moving. Come on, come on. We have one more set. 
10 seconds. Keep moving. You got it. Five. Booty burning. Four. Three. Two. Go. Reach. Hinge. Walk it out. Two push ups. So this is your last minute in this block. You got it, Allison. Keep moving. Perfect. Ten to go. So toe taps, plank jacks, but both exercises are firing into that booty. You have eight seconds left, so give me one more full set. When you stand up in five, four, tap jacks, three, two, you got it, Paula, let's go, 30 seconds. Now, if you executed this last three minutes appropriately, two and a half so far, keep moving. You should be thrilled in 20 seconds when I say we're going to remove that minivan from our ankles. Come on, 15 seconds, you got it. There you go. Let that heart rate come up, team. Because if you give yourself the best 10 seconds you've got right here, I will give you a full opportunity to breathe and grab water. Yes, Allison, I love it. Four, three, two, break. Remove the minivan from your ankles. So I have two exercises, primarily upper body still with the minivan. So, I said I'd give you 45 seconds, you're 15 in, which means in 30 seconds you put your mini band around your wrist. These squats are going to feel so good because you have no tension on your lower body. So you squat down, open the arms, rope it back, extend it out, stand up. So squat, you have to open, fight the mini band, pull it back, extend it, release. You have about five seconds to get that mini bend on your wrist. Four, three, two, go. Squat, open, pull, elbows drive past your ribs, extend it out, bring it in, stand up. You can release that tension there. Open, pull, extend, release. So make your hands into fists. Feel the tops of your shoulders activate as you fight the tension of that mini band. We're gonna give the lower body a break in just 10 seconds, but the mini band stays on our wrist. You got it, come on, last one. Now, reset, stand up, mini band stays on your wrist. Send the mini band with the, send your wrist over your right hip. Now, draw your left arm up, bicep by your ears. Send your thumbs back, open up the chest, stretch the mini band, bring it down to your left hip. Do it again. Reach your arms up, open, stretch. So I want you to see that my arms come back over my right hip. This is great power, great energy in your shoulders, great work. Big, tuck your ribs in. Come on, we're going to the other side one more time. Big stretch, fist created, over to the left hip. Come back to center. Ready, go. Squat, open, pull, extend, release. Squat, open, pull, extend, release. Take your time. And I just want you to be amazed, I hope you're feeling the same thing, with how good your lower body feels. You're like, I've got no tension there. Shoulders, different story. Keep going, you have 10 seconds. Where are the fists? You're trying to break that mini band. And three, two. So stand up tall, take a break from the lower body, pass the mini band over your left hip. You're leading with the right arm, creating a rainbow. Sending your thumbs back, opening up the chest. Right hand comes past your right hip. Do it again. Left arm, open, left side. This is mobility in your shoulders. This is strengthening. This is good for you. You got it, yes. And if your mini band 
is a little bit looser or tighter, that will affect how your shoulders feel in this exercise. Last one. Come back to center. Mini band around the wrist, third set. Squat, open, pull, extend, release. You got it. Squat, pull, extend, release. 15 seconds. As you draw the elbows back, your goal is to get those elbows just past your ribs. So to do that, you have to make room. Last one. Stand up. Mini band extended towards the right hip. Left arm leads, draw it up. Send it back, open it up. Left shoulder, left hip. I know what that body part is. So there is tension on this mini band the entire 30 seconds that you're here. But the good news is, in about 15 seconds, we'll take that mini band off our wrist. We'll come down to the floor. 10 seconds. Come on, let's take it all the way to the left. Last time. And break. Ooh, shoulders feel good. So, take your mini band, we're gonna come down to the floor. Mini band is above your knees. Okay. So, this set, I have three different exercises. The first exercise is a butterfly bridge. So your feet are connected to each other, knees are open, you know, like gymnastic class when you're like seven and eight butterfly, that's where you are. Mini band is above the knees, so there's tension there. And then lay down on your back. When I say go, so your knees are already open, creating some tension. When I say go, you lift your hip bones up towards the ceiling and lower them down. That's where we start in four. Knees are open, three, two, go. So lift, lower, lift, lower. There should, right out of the gate, be a little bit of vibration through your core as you send the hip bones up, but keep the ribs tucked in. Now in 10 seconds, we transition to a right side plank. The mini band will not move in five, in four, three, two, so rotate to a right side plank. You have options. Feet can be stacked, right knee can be down, but everybody's left arm is up. Now, can you lift that left leg up? Flex your left foot, pulse it up. Just pulse it up right there. Eight seconds, pulse. Now we're gonna execute the right and left each time. So you have four, you have three, two, rotate. You should be able to just flip over, but I wanna face you. So now left side plank, feet stacked, hips stacked, arm up. Lift that right leg up now and pulse it. Toes face forward. It's a little micro pulse to start. You have 10 seconds. We're gonna lay on our back in eight seconds. Come on, bottom hip doesn't move. Three, two, lay down on your back. Slide your hands underneath your hips. Send your heels up towards the ceiling. Head can be down, open up your legs. So pulse your legs open, 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 open. Now as you pulse your legs open, 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 can you drop them to about 45 degrees? When you get to 45 degrees, can you pulse them open, 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 back up towards the ceiling? Keep going, 15 seconds. With your hands under your hips, little pulses, your lower back stays glued to the ground. Come on, we got one more set. Pulse it, pulse it, pulse it, pulse it, and heels together. Come back into that butterfly bridge. So feet together, knees open. Let's lift and lower. Go. Change that music. Lift and lower. Something more fun. Lift and lower. First 15 seconds. There we go. Move and ah, this will be good. Okay, now we're ready for a little bit more team. Hold it up. So hold your hips up, heels are connected, knees are open, pulse it up. 
10, 9, 8, 7. Belly is pulled into the spine. You've got 6, 5, 4, 3. We'll start left side plank in 2 and go. Left side plank. Feet can be stacked. Knees can be stacked. You do you. Reach your right arm up. Lift your right leg up. Tap your right toe down in front of your left toe. Lift your right leg back up. Tap your right toe down. Lift it back up. We have four more. Right toe down. Lift it back up. Three. Reset the hip. Two. Last one. Switch. Right side plank. So I give you the first 10 seconds to find your foundation. Lift your left leg up. Toe taps down in front of the right. Lift it back up. Toe taps down. Lift it back up. You got it. Three more. Take your time. Two more. The closest it comes to resting is tapping the floor and on your back. Legs are up, hands underneath your hips. Heels are extended, legs are straight. Pulse open. And you can stay right here, and this is all good. You can slowly drop it down to the 45. Maybe you can go a little lower, but always bring it back up. Constant tension, constant movement. You want more? Lift your head, neck, and shoulders up. So that's the lower abdominals, outer glutes, outer thighs. Come on, we got 10 seconds. There we go. Perfect. Come on, we got five seconds. Drive your heels up. Four, three. The good news is it's only two sets. Last one. And break. Remove the mini band from your knees. Come up and shake out. I'm going to grab a quick sip of water. Okay. Who's ready for more upper body? A little bit more upper body, but you know me. Mini band power to the glutes, I love it. So, first exercise, you will take that mini band and put it around the arch of your left leg. I'm gonna give you about 20 seconds to get here because I want to show you both exercises. First exercise, single arm row, we're keeping it basic. The second exercise, it stays on the left foot and we will stand up, still holding with our right hand and move into a single leg deadlift, okay? So, everybody has the mini band around your left foot, right hand holding it, spine is long, three, two, go. Pull, pull. Imagine there's a button right behind your elbow. Not even right behind it, behind your body. So every time you pull that mini band, your elbow taps the button. You should feel stabilizing power in your left hamstring and left glute. And that's going to help get us ready for that next element. Hold the right arm back. Pulse it. Pulse that single arm row for eight, seven, six, and five, four, shoulder back, three, two, break. Now, right hand keeps the minivan, stand up. Right hand has a minivan, it's still on the arch of your left foot, stand up. Now hinge forward onto that left leg, press into the left heel, stand all the way up. Option to draw the right knee up. Hinge forward. If the balancing is not for you, you are welcome to tap your left toe down. So all of that work here is in the left side. You got it, Paula. Take your time. I know you're there, Liz. I know you're feeling this love. You have eight seconds, and my gift to you, we remove it from the left foot. Three, two, shake it out. So remove it from the left, pop it on your right left knee down. Left hand has the mini band. Four, three, two, go. Pull, pull. 30 seconds, just the pull. Thumb to the rib, eyes are down. Belly in, keep moving. 15 seconds. You got it. 
In 10 seconds, regroup that mini bend. It comes out of your hand. You hold it back. Come on, Lisa. Last four. Three. You're ready to hold in. Two more. And last one. Hold it. Pulse it. Ten, nine. Eight, seven. Looking strong, Julie. Six and five. Drive that elbow back. Four, three, two. Keep it in your left hand. Stand up. So press into your right heel. Toe is down. Ready, go. Hinge. Stand up. You can draw the knee up. The slower you go, the more muscles your body recruits to stabilize. Take your time. There you go, you got it. So I say this occasionally. Yoga gets to be called practice. Why can't this be called practice? Last one. And break. We're going back to the other side. One more time. One more time. So mini band on your left foot, right knee is down. Right hand past the mini band. Leaning forward, hinging forward. Let's go. Single counts to start. <sighs> Drive the elbow back. Now, I'm going to change this up just a little bit. Can you give me a two count? So can you pull for two, resist that tension for two? Pull for two, resist that tension for two. We have two more of these. Resist that tension. This is your last one. Then we're going to hold it back. So pull it back again, hold it back, and pulse it back. Can you make that pulse a little bit bigger for seven and six? For five and four, that shoulder's rubbing back for three, two, keep the minivan where it is, stand up. At, feel your glute activate, you know I do this all the time. Put your hands on your butt. Do you feel it working? Now you're ready, let's go. Hinge, eyes come down, stand up, press into your heel. Check it out, team. If you break your mini band while you're doing this, email me and I will send you a new one. But that's how much tension you want to create, how much space from the floor to your right hand. Let's do one more. Point your right knee to the floor. Stand up and shake it out. Other side, one more set. Mini band around your right foot. Left hand has it, palm faces your body. Three, two, go. Start with the singles. And you probably think, to I'm only working my lats, the muscles are up around the back of your ribs. Not true. Stabilizers in your leg, stabilizers in your core. Ready for that two count? Last one, two counts. Two count pull, two count resist. Maybe take notice of your right oblique supporting this movement because you're pressing your right heel down. Two more. Last one. Now pull it back, hold it back. Pulse it. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Stand up. Last one. Right toe down, that's not true. Left toe down, that's true. Ready, go. Ooh. Hopefully your eyes are on something that's not moving. This is 30 seconds here, team. Rocking it out. <laughs> 15 seconds. So here's how we're gonna wrap up the last roughly 10 minutes of class. We still have 10 seconds left. We're gonna take off that mini band for a quick core block, and then we'll put it on for our power finishers in four, three, two, and break. So shake it out, drop the mini band. I always like to take a moment and say, isn't it amazing one piece of equipment? I hope you feel a whole body workout. So, Here's what's on deck, a core block. I have four different exercises, one minute each. Here's our first one, I'll show you the options. Option number one, we start on our belly. 
One superhero where you lift up, squeeze the glutes, lower back. Then you either put your hands down and open up to a side plank or you put your elbows down and open up into a side plank. Then you come down and you do it again. So everybody has 10 seconds to get down on their belly. So you have two options. Hopefully one of them works for you. Hips are anchored down on the ground. Eyes are down. I have one minute on my clock in three, two, go. Lift, down. Hands under shoulders. Press up, side plank. Bring it all the way down. Lift, squeeze. Up, side plank, down, lower. So you're here for one minute. If a high plank doesn't work, elbows, press your chest away from the ground, reach the arm up. You're 30 seconds down, 30 to go. The core is everything between your shoulders and your hips. You have 15 seconds. Then we lay down on our back. 10 seconds. So when we come to our back in four, knees in tabletop position, three, two, on your back. Hands against your knees, knees against your hands, your favorite. Press your belly glued down to the floor, head, neck, and shoulders can be up. Now extend your left arm and your left leg. Bring it back. I want so much power in that right arm and right leg. Keep going. If the head, neck, and shoulders is too much, put it down. We have two more on the left. <sighs> Inhale as you lengthen. Exhale. Switch sides. Right side. So you're holding something, your vaccine card. I don't want to get too political, but you're holding your vaccine card between your left hand and your left thigh. There you go. You have five seconds. We're going to turn over in four, in three, two, flip over, high plank. High plank. If you're on your elbows, bring with your hips. If you're in a high plank, join me. Roll your right arm back. Put it down. Roll your left arm back. Put it down. Reach your right arm forward. Put it down. Left arm forward. Put it down. You're joining me. Lift your hips up. Right hand to left toe. Left hand to right. Left side leads. Left row. Right row. Left reach. Right reach. Left hand to right. Right hand to left. We have one more each side. Row, row. Reach, reach. Tap, tap. Last set. Left, right, left. Hips are quiet. Right. Last one. Left and right. Lay down on your back. Last core exercise here. Extend your legs so they're about 45 degrees. Extend your arms so your biceps are by your ears. Inhale through your nose. Exhale, come up to bow pose. Do it again. Legs extend. Arms extend. Sweep your arms around. Come up and rest. Do it again. Team, you have 30 seconds left here. Now we're going to finish with our cardio and then we're done. I love it. Keep moving. Sweep, yes, gently, just like that. <clears throat> Come on, 10 seconds. <sighs> Three more. You got it, Julie, that looks awesome, yes, two more. Come on, last one, how about last one? Sure, yes, follow up, great, shake it out. Shake it out. Grab your mini band. Grab your mini band. So, I have options for you for our last two exercises. Two exercises, 30 seconds each, twice, and then you're done. 
two exercises. First exercise, almost everyone, it can jack or tap. Now, second exercise, you know me, I love the burpees. You're like a burpee with the mini band? Oh yeah. So you're down, you can come all the way down, you're in, you're up. If you're like, no, I'm not gonna do that, then you'll give me a strong scissor. So you get to do you. But in 10 seconds, everybody starts with jacks. Mini bands around your ankles, we're finishing strong here in four, in three, two, let's go. Jack and jack, it's only 30 seconds. I want you to bend your elbows, pick up that pace. There you go. This is a two minute finisher. And at about this point, I hope your glutes are feeling so good. Yes. Come on, you have 10 seconds. Now you're deciding, are you gonna move into burpees or scissors in four, in three, two, you do you, go. So burpees, you don't wanna bring your chest all the way to the ground. You come down, you hop back, you step in, you stand up. You do you. If you're scissoring, drive the arms. Chest is tall. You only have 10 seconds left here. Keep moving. Oh, I love you guys. You're amazing. Come on, five, four, three, two, stand up, jack it out. You have one minute here. Scale of one to 10, eight. It's very precise. That means you can say your first, middle, and maybe your last name. Come on, last 10 seconds. What are you gonna do next to finish yourself off? Are you going to the burpees? Or are you gonna scissor? Four, three, two, go, 30 seconds. Burpees or scissor, this is it. This is it, you got it, love it, Paula. Keep moving. If you are scissoring, use your arms. Make it big. You can be here, make it bigger. Bigger, bigger. There you go, you only have 15 seconds, Allison, I love it. Oh yeah. Come on, 10 seconds, count it down your head. I'm queuing up that cool down song for you. It's five seconds away. Three, two, and break. Shake it out. Take the minivan off. Shake it out. Bring your arms out wide. Press your left arm across your body. Pull your shoulder away from your ear over your left shoulder. Now, isn't that amazing how much you can do with one teeny tiny piece of equipment? Switch. Right arm across the body. Shoulder away from your ear. And if you've done other mini band workouts with me, you know that triceps are another easy one to execute with that mini band. You can get all of it in. Reach your arms up to the sky, the ceiling. Draw your elbows down and back. Look over your right shoulder and then over your left. You're pressing your elbows back while you do this and come back to center, shake it out. Cross your right ankle over your left knee. Right ankle over your left knee. Hands can come together for balance. If it feels good, wiggle into that hip a little bit. We did a lot of glutes today. Release, switch, left ankle, right knee. Same thing, wiggle into that hip a little bit. And release, bring your legs out wide. Lateral lunge to the right. So you're opening up the inner thigh. And then walk the hands over, lateral lunge to the left. This time, lateral lunge to the right. Rotate towards the right. You can either tap the knee down or drop it down to the ground if you have a mat, or you can stay standing, but shift your body forward, squeezing the back loop to open up the back hip. So if you shift in the same direction as me, you should be squeezing your left glute to release your left hip and leaning your body into that stretch. Perfect. Uh, uh, lift your knee up, hands come down, rotate back to center. We gotta execute it on the other side. Rotate left. Same thing, tap the knee down if that feels good. If not, just come up. 
Extend that forward. Squeeze the glute, release the quad. And come back to center, straight your legs, hang your head. We have one more thing, soft bend in the knees, slowly round up one vertebrae at a time. Heel toe the feet in, and you know what I ask for at the end of every class. As your beautiful deep breath in through the nose, where you inhale the fact that you are awesome for starting the day this way, and exhale, have a wonderful rest of your week.